Hello, ladies and gentlemen. Marauder EX here, back with more Let's Play Castlevania Symphony of the Night. All right, so I'm here in the regular castle. I need to get below the librarian. There's something that was there that we're like, hey, we need to come back here for, but I wanted to wait until after I had... until after I had already been to the other castle because of an item that can appear. So that's what I'm going to do. And we're going to just kind of run around as the wolf because that makes getting to these places a little bit easier. I say that and then I'm 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 going to need the the item that I've got on me, the increased MP restoration. Cuz what we need to do is we're going to need to jump a lot underneath here. So, yeah. This is going to take a while, and I, I truly loathe this section. The first time you do a double jump, or a, a super jump up to there, you get a life max up. And then... The more you do this, other items will drop. And you have to just not hit the librarian on a ceiling for it to count. You can touch the ground... You can recover MP, whatever, but you, you, you just want to keep sitting here giving this old man the ride of his life. And yes, that that is a thing. That sounds raunchy. And it kind of is. And... It takes a lot of practice to do this. Like, I suck at the double jump, or the, the super jump thing. Like, I really suck at it. But, you know. And it's going to take me a while to get all this. I've actually thought about doing most of this off screen, but I want to get at least the second item, and I will probably do the rest off screen. So I can continue with the game, because this is just obnoxious, right? Like, this is mind-numbing. Who put this in this game? And can I... Can I hurt them? Like, really? So, so obnoxious. And oh my god, it's taking forever. I at least got the next item shortly after this. Like, the last time I tried this. Okay, there's one. We've got the Axe Lord armor. We do that. Where becomes an Axe Knight? What? And now, we are an Axe Knight. And this is not even the item I want. But like, this is ridiculous. If you want to play the game on super, almost impossible mode, this is the way to do it. Alright, we're going to put the wall armor back on. And the other items are... There's a Ring of Arcana, which makes rare items drop more, uh, more commonly. And then there is Dracula's Tunic. Which is really arguably the best armor in the game. Like, I think the Walk armor statistically is better because it um, it has the potential to have a higher base defense but because you have basically 200% castle and actually over 200% castle if you want to get super technical about it. So... But yeah, it takes a little while to do all of that, so yeah, especially since you have to recover MP in between. Um, so I may just stop here and do the rest off screen. In fact, I think I probably will. So I will, I'll see you all in just a moment. Okay, so I'm back in the reverse castle now. We've got all the items that we need. We've got Dracula's Tunic Embroidered Nobleman's Tunic. And 
it really doesn't do much for defense, but it does everything else. So we've got that, and then we got the Ring of Arcana, increases rear item appearance. I've got the Steel Helm equipped, and I'm pretty decked out for now, so I'm doing all right. So what we're going to do is we're going to explore this upside down castle. And there's actually a bunch of stuff here. So basically anywhere there was an item in the last castle, there is an item here. And we get a fantastic skeleton here. That's Skull. And that's Yorick. Get it? Alas, poor Yorick. I knew him well. He lost his head. Come on, th these are the jokes. And then over here we've got a high potion, which I got one of those off of the flea armor, or the armored fleamen. And then we get a bunch of resists. So, yay, resist items. Not that I'm going to ever be using them, but yeah. There's Yorick again. And I hate... I hate the jumps. So there's nothing here, because we already knew that was a thing. There's not an equivalent cross, though. There was a cross. And that's not there, so that's weird. We can come over here, and where we got the Power of Mist, there's going to be something else over here. Hey, it's, it's you! We haven't seen you in forever. Over here is going to be something useless. An iron ball. There's nothing else here, which is kind of useless. But up here is probably one of my favorite items ever. And we come up here. Come. There we go. So we get this. And then... Can I, can I just attack this with the bat? Will that do it? Will that make it easier? Yes. We get the Sword of Dawn. This is one of my favorite weapons. It's a two-handed sword, which makes it not really all that useful. Like, it's got a really slow attack speed, but it's got a huge attack radius. But it has a special attack where it summons a bunch of... Like, that's the super attack where it summons an army. Regularly, it will summon one troop of a type, either a uh, a spear or swordsman, a uh, archer, a caster, or, like, it's just usually one, but, like, getting all of those troops is actually kind of cute. So, thank you for showing that off, game. Uh, all right. Oh, also, I got a banana from uh, one of the Donkey Kong skeletons, you know, because that doesn't seem dark in a way. So there's really nothing else here other than map completion for us. So that's what I'm going to do here is just we're going to we're going to complete some of the map and then we're going to go get some more items. Because there's a lot of items to get here. Because, hey, we have a... We basically have a whole, you know, castle to explore. Like, this is like starting the game over again. Like, that's actually really what it is. We are... We really kind of are starting the game over again. Alright, let's get this. I can't wait till I get the wing smash. Actually, I might be able to do the wing smash now. That is a... An ability, but... Let's see, where's the best way to go about all this? I think this entrance might be the best. Let's go over here. Because we've got all of this area now to explore. There's nothing in here, but there is a single library card here. So, you know, if you wanted to make it back to the other, ta other castle, this is the game's way of telling you, you can! And up here, that is the, that's the, the, 
Really? Okay, that is the teleport room. Where? Oh, no, that's just the other... Okay. The other area. This is the teleport room up here, which means there's... I love how we can fly through that. That's that's neat. And we get the lightning mail. Not that I will ever be... Actually, that is useful against... Against Gallimoth. At least it can be useful against Gallimoth. So... But hey... I'm gonna come over here and teleport room. So now the teleport rooms have little elevators that take you up into the the keyhole section, because that's, you know, at least they thought ahead that way. Where do I want to go? Um, I can deal with a bat or I can deal with Medusa. Let's deal with a bat. I feel like a bat's gonna be more entertaining. Like. I could, I could be wrong. I'm probably wrong, but it's a bat. And you're just going to, really? No, I don't want to try to block the wind. I want to hit him with swords. There we go. Dead bat. Darkwing duck. I mean, Darkwing bat. And here we get an item. Obtained ring of Vlad. We're going to start getting items from Vlad. Oh, hey. I need to turn my sword card back on. Ring of Vlad. Intelligence plus 10. So as long as we have that, we can just have 10 extra intelligence. For shits and giggles, really. Alright, we'll get a shuriken. Wait, can I take a minute? Sure you can. <laughs> oh, I I get it. We get some TNT. And I think... Is there an item up here? Yep. A block a knife. Which I've already got a couple of those because of... Uh, one of the... The spectral swords. And... We've got bomb knights. There is a bomberman joke to be made here, I'm sure, but... Not quite there yet. And we can come over here, and that was a place that we had to unlock the first time. And we get the moon rod. In the name of the moon, I shall punish you. And that's... I may actually switch to that, because that's... actually just as effective as the, uh... the shield rod. And I think this has a higher base attack. Yeah. By one, so... But I don't have to rely on the special attack. I can just... I don't have to rely on using that. I, I can just do that. Like, see? It's got kind of a low attack speed, but it's it's useful. So, I want that. We've got the, the moon rod. There are some, some more items in here. Really? Okay. I'm okay with that. There's a pot roast somewhere around here. And probably not the direction I'm going, but because the direction I'm going is not where I'm actually supposed to be going. So you are just kind of the most useless bomb knight because you you can't throw the bomb in a way that will actually ever hit me. Oh, that was awesome! Thank you, sword. That was neat. All right, so not there. You are the second most useless bomb knight. Uh, sure, I'll take the dagger for now. And I want to come up here, and... One of these... There's the pot roast. Like, I, I actually really kind of hate... All of this... 
But I do love the, the sword deflected the bomb, killed the bomb knight, and I got a level up off that. That was just... That was quite fortuitous. And there's nothing up here. So, uh, we've basically covered this room. And, yeah, we've basically covered this room. There's one square. I should do better about that, but I'm not going to. Alright, so... The Cloaked Knights. I'm going to want to kill them, because they can drop an awesome sword as well. So, that's something to keep in mind. And I've got the Ring of Arcana, so it should help. But I also know that should in this game is kind of a, a wide area. Oh, hey, look, there's another one. And we get... We get that. Alright, he didn't drop it. They can drop two items. They can drop one sword that no one really cares about, and then they can drop the Heaven Sword. Oh, hey! And... Yeah. Come on. Yeah, I'm, I'm not gonna kill him. I'm gonna kill the one outside here, because it's really a lot easier to kill them. And this is also a good place to farm money if you want to, you know, because you're going to have to be coming back in and out of this room. Alright, that did not go. Oh, hey, there's a third one up there. I forgot about him. And I'm actually going to want to equip the, the Mirror Curse while I'm here, because... That's so yeah. Basically, what you want to do is not get knocked back, and you know, actually get the items, and not get knocked into other areas. So this actually might be the best way to do. It. Why are they are they going too far into the other room? I think they are. So this this is the best way to do this. And like I said, I've got the Ring of Arcana, which should help, but it's it's not really doing much at the moment. But in fact, I'm not getting any item drops off of you. I want the sword, you little bastard. I want a sword. Drop something. Like you've got a two-item treasure pool. You could drop something. Like... Okay, there's one. The Flamberge. Like, that's... that's a... that is a giant two-handed sword. It's... As far as I know, it doesn't have any special attack. Oh no, it does have the, the lunge, so. So we, we can lunge at things now. So, yeah. That's, that's wonderful. I may try to get the Heaven Sword off screen, but it's going to take a while. So, especially at the rate things seem to be going. But, uh, yeah, so... That's one of the fun things that we need to deal with, and the downside is that they are also hurting me. Like they they can they can put a little bit of a world of hurt on me, so I want to be careful about that. Oh hey no, that didn't come back. Why did that not come back? I was hoping for more 250. <sighs> really? Thank you. Really? Well, that that and see the the problem is you want two heaven swords as well. Like you don't want just one. They're like Pringles. 
you can't have just one. Like, you, you, you gotta have two of them to make them super useful. And then we also have to do the, uh, I think we have to do the, uh, the thing where you gotta hit all the, yeah, you gotta hit all these still too, so. Yeah. Um, that's something I'm gonna need to do. I'll start the next episode by dealing with that. So yeah, um, I'll see you all in the next installment, so till then, later everyone.